Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Get day to day videos to know about the logic and solution for skill rack daily challenge. Daily challenge will not be much challenging if you are going to subscribe our channel right now. Let us understand our question. In a game, there are n rooms numbered from 0 to n minus 1. That is, the rooms are from 0 to n minus 1 rooms. Like if we have the total number of rooms as 7, then the rooms are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now each room will have the key to open another room or the same room. Like if 0th room contains the key to open any other room. And now the boy has a magical key so that he chooses any room and open it first. So the boy can choose any room to open. So they have also given a note. If the boy reaches the same room, then the game ends. That is, if the boy reaches the same room where he started, then the game ends. Now, we have to print the maximum number of rooms the boy can open. So, consider our first test case, where the total number of rooms is 7. And our main idea is, consider every room as the starting room. That is, if the boy is starting from 5, then 4, 0, 3, 1, 6, 2, like that. So, for every iteration, the starting room will be changed. If you are starting from 5, then the key it has the key for the fifth index. So, the count will be incremented by 1. So, the fifth index is 6. Count will be 1. Then, 6. For 6, the six, it has the key for the 6th index, so it is 2, so count will be incremented. Then for the 2, it has 0, that is the 2nd index, so the count will be 3, and for 0, it will be 5. Now, we have reached the same room where the boy started, so the count will be 4, and the program, I'm sorry, and the game ends. Now, we have to get the maximum possible base from the possible combinations that starting from every room. Now, let us implement our program. First, we'll get the total number of rooms, then the rooms with keys. Then, we will initialize the possible waves as an empty list. At last, we are going to print the maximum possible waves. Now we'll run a for loop for index in range 0, n. Now we will run this loop to iterate every room as our starting room to find the count. So the count is 0. That is the number of rooms the boy can open. Now the key is equal to the rooms index. Now this represents the starting room. Now the key is equal to rooms of index means the key the index have. So now we'll use the while while key is not equal to index so if the key is not equal to the starting index then we are going to increment count by 1 then key is equal to rules of key so now we will append the possible ways with count plus 1. Since the while loop terminates priorly, the last move will not be count, so we will add plus 1 to the count. So we have used the count plus 1. Now we will print the maximum of the possible ways. So let us execute our program. We'll run our first test case 
we have got 4 as our output which is correct as discussed in our logic video. Now we will run our second test case. We have got 7 as our output which is correct. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.